and loads of my and I am a lion. And sometimes on the interwebs, I make video things. And sometimes I make mazes. And at the moment, I'm incredibly excited about both. Also, I am a lion. Now, recently on the YouTubes, I saw a video by the user named Rick Perry, who's trying to become president or something. And I thought the video was hilarious. He's going on and on talking about how he's not ashamed to be a Christian, and he's appalled because the people in the military can say that they're gay, and that as president, he will end Obama's war on religion. I thought it was hilarious. For multiple reasons. For one, if you make a video like that, you're never going to become elected as president. And two, he thinks Obama has a war on religion. I was excited about it. And now it's time for Neil's new segment. Neil is insane. Here's what I honestly think. Rick Perry has a lot of people working for him that know exactly what people want to see and what will get him elected. They're called publicists or Republicans. Now, not a single one of those people would be like, hey, this is a good idea. Let's alienate 90% of the people who live in this country, assuming that this country is 90% competent. And now you look on the other side of the fence and you have Mr. Mitt Romney, whose only crime is being a religious crazy. Coincidence? I think not. According to some poll somewhere, Obama's rating is down right now, which means that Republican people might have a shot of actually becoming elected. So Mitt Romney made a deal with Rick Perry, such that Rick Perry will make himself look even more like a religious crazy. So Mitt Romney has a chance. It is the only thing that could possibly make sense in this situation. No person, no matter how far their head is up their ass, would possibly think that it would be a good idea to release a video like this. If you haven't seen it, there's a link below. The video is hilarious. I got a couple of comments on my channel and on some of my videos being like, hey, Neil, why did you like that video? It's homophobic and terrible. Yes, it is homophobic and terrible, but it's also really, really funny. I burst out laughing almost immediately when he started talking. Now, I know some of you out there would be worried that he is serious, but do you remember the bedroom intruder guy? Climbing in your window, snatching your people up. He was being serious too. And don't lie, you thought that video was hilarious also. Other political deviants on the schedule today? I wanted to talk for a minute about SOPA, otherwise known as the Protect IP Act. Now, I'm sure most of you know it as the act that's going to fine people $5,000 for watching copyrighted material at home. And it's gonna start shutting down parts of the internet and stuff like that. Which is so ridiculous. Under no circumstances was that ever going to pass. You know what this really was? It was the government being like, hey, I'm gonna raise taxes 20%. And then everybody bands together and fights against it and says, no, we can't raise taxes 20%. And then after thousands of dollars are spent and tons of energy and time are spent trying to fight this bill, the government comes back a little while later and it's like, hey, let's raise taxes 5%. And then it gets passed because it's better by comparison. So when they come back with another bill that's trying to rip apart the internet and the money and the time and the effort's already been spent, they're gonna have a better chance of getting it passed. So keep an eye out for that one. It's a thing that's gonna happen. Recently, I've been producing face follicles. I'm fairly certain that it's gonna be gone by the end of the week, but if you guys have an opinion on whether or not you like it or not, there's a little comment box down below. You should type a comment and do that stuff and be a lion and I'm gonna go. Okay, I apologize. I'm gonna come back soon with another video. Hello, this is Matthew Nano, and I am a lion and stuff and things. And occasionally I do this thing where I make videos on the internet. But the one thing that is better than the videos that I make are the videos that I. Yeah. Turn aside if that's funny enough. I don't know. This is me being a lion. By the way, kids, three days from now, I'm gonna put out a creative video that I spent like 38 hours editing or something like that, which I did in a span of two days, which is kind of crazy. Actually, that's when this facial stuff started happening. It was a thing where I was living at the library. Anyway, I'm a lion and I'm gonna go, but I wanted to let you know that you should come back in three days and hang out with me for the video that I made, okay. Rawr.